fight him and, and vacate his title. I can't remember what it was. And then Andy Lee went on to knock him out and get the strap, the WBO strap. Uh, and then uh, Andy Lee got the title taken from, uh, got his title taken by Billy Joe Saunders. I believe that's who Billy Joe got the title off of. But, uh, you know, this is really strange in my opinion. And I believe there's some irony here because we saw Victor Conte coming out against Billy Joe Saunders. And it, it sucks because I don't like Billy Joe Saunders to be, you know, saying something that might, you know, sound like I'm taking up for him or whatever. But Victor Conte, the same guy who he's coming out saying, um, you know, we I knew that that Billy Joe was on something because he was losing all this weight um, so quickly. And then a fighter that you're working with, he said that he, he works with, with Willie Monroe Jr. He's a, you know, his little company, Snack Nutrition or whatever. Um, he said he works with Willie Monroe Jr. And he works with Demetrius Andre. And now one of your fighters is, is you know, coming up dirty or whatever. You know, so that's highly ironic. And then, I mean, we already know Victor Conte is, you know, uh, a shady individual anyway, because, you know, we saw the whole Balco scandal and I believe uh, Shane Mosley was involved in that. He was taking steroids. So he he's already been juicing um, athletes before and he tries to come off as this guy that's, um, you know, somebody who's, who has done dirt in the past. And he's he's here trying to. Um, you know, be a spokesman, like he's gonna know that these guys are cheating before other people because he was supplying these guys the drugs before. But he's probably still supplying these guys drugs, but he knows um, ways to get around the testing. So, you know, it'd be my advice, man. If, if, you know, any of these fighters out here associated with Victor Conte, man, you know, they need to get away from him. Um, I know Devin Haney's a snack fighter. So, I mean, hey, man, they need to, you know, rethink you know what they doing and um and fast and it's kind of ironic because i uh, i thought that victor conte was somehow linked to vada and vada's the one who caught um willie monroe jr so i mean i don't know it's kind of strange man I, I, how could he get popped by the same agency that victor conte is is associated with i would think he would he'd be able to get him out of it somehow. So we'll see. Um, the fight hasn't been officially canceled, but a lot of people are saying that it's going to get canceled. And this guy, Matt Corbov is going to be the replacement. But um, I want to see what happens. If Monroe Jr. gets out of this somehow, then we know that, um, you know, Victor Conte got some pull with Vada. And everything ain't so, you know, um, the, the golden standard over there, you know, because everybody tries to say Vada is, you know, the golden standard, man. Um, if it, Willie Monroe Jr. is able to get out of this, you know, might have some, some warning signs. But I'm, I'm wondering what he, he popped dirty for because they're saying that they found adverse findings um, in his urine sample. So I'm wondering what he popped dirty for. You know, we'll, we'll hear about it in the next coming days. But, man, it's a lot of fighters getting popped um, recently, man. We had Billy Joe. We had the biggest, which was uh, Canelo. Now we got uh, Willie Monroe Jr. Uh, before that, I, I want to say it was somebody else who, who got popped. That was a, a big name. I can't I can't remember. But, uh, man, a lot of these guys are getting popped, man. It's kind of like um, what I felt all this time. I feel like all these guys at the elite level are taking some kind of PDs. I feel like everybody's taking PDs. It's just um, some people are taking worse than others. Well, I don't know, man. I don't really know, but it, it seems like everybody's getting popped, you know, but it's a lot of these guys that you can look at them and there are a lot of the super muscular guys that's being able to go up and weight and, and still hold size. Um, it's these guys that's getting popped, you know. But anyway, man, that's my thought, man. Again, Willie Monroe Jr. has popped dirty. The fight's going to get canceled, most likely. And Korbov is going to be Matt Korbov, the former um, WBO title contender. Um, it's, it's looking like he's going to be the replacement. 
anyway this is since 93 sports make sure you like comment subscribe and hit the bell icon to be notified when all my latest content drops and i'm out